Willkommen zurück bei der letzten Staffel von The Walking Dead. In der letzten Episode. Spektakulärer Anfang. Und wir gucken, wie es weitergeht. We need to move. We'll have to squeeze through there. We don't know where it goes. Well, we do know there's walkers in the other direction. But... Move it, dummy! This is a castle, so... Good enough. Safe, but not for long. Damn it, it's so dark in here. This sucks. This really fucking sucks. I'll figure something out. Okay, Bowen. to burn. Might look nice in our room. Just have to get home first. Okay. It's a bonus loot. Ich würde aber nichts. Clem, did you did you see Minnie out there? I didn't see her anywhere. But that doesn't mean she escaped. I saw her on the beach. She was bitten, Ten. So she'll go to the next place with Sophie. They can be together. That's good. Sag mir über die Wahrheit. Gibt's ja sowieso raus. Sind wir dabei? Ich aus dem Hemd vielleicht. another tunnel over there. It's too far. Well, we just gotta... We gotta find something to help us cross. Clem, the walkers are getting closer. Don't worry. We'll be home before you know it. Hmm. Too far for us to jump across. Be something we can use as a bridge. Did you lose a Is this it? If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. Could work as a bridge. Yeah, we proceed.
Okay, we just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way. And then I'll take Oops. Ten! Did you get that? jetzt da. Gut. Bin ja noch nicht gestorben in der Folge. Hier jetzt wieder raus. Das ist auch wieder so eine Sache. All right, which way do we go? Ten, do you see a light down any of these tunnels? AJ, still with me? AJ, please. We have to keep moving. There's... there's nothing after this. What? James isn't in there. He looked right at me, and... and his eyes were empty. There's nothing after we die. Nothing but empty eyes. AJ, I know he was your friend, and I know this is terrible. Please don't say you're sorry. Okay. <gasps> Why did you make me make my friend go away? Everything is just, just wrong. Like something spilled on the floor and you just can't get it back. Because you didn't let me shoot her. James's death is not on you. I made the call, and Lily is the one who stabbed him. And me. It's on me, too. I... Quiet! James shouldn't have been there, AJ. None of this was supposed to happen. What? I, I can't hold all of that in my head. It's okay to be confused. 
I don't be soft, but everything that you do just messes up my head. Be strong. Be brave. If something wants to hurt us, shoot it right in the head. <sighs> AJ. When we were talking with Abel, you stabbed him and stopped him from becoming a monster. You made killing look so easy. And you burned him with the cigarette. And you banged his head real hard on that desk. AJ, please. That's enough. I'm sorry. I'm just scared something will take you away. Aren't you scared of that too? Having to leave the world behind? And me? Listen, kiddo. Everyone is scared of dying. Of what happens after. Especially if it's nothing. people I care about to leave, Clem. I have to kill anyone that tries to take them away. I do. I believed you when you called me a murderer about Marlin. I don't think that murder means the same thing as it did when you were little. In a world that's gone now. I think that murder now is just protecting the people around you. Murder is a thing that makes us safe. Enough, AJ. Murder is murder, nothing else. A human life is precious. No, food is precious. Bullets are precious. We need those to live. But we don't need bad people who make things wrong. You're too young to understand. You're just a child. So are you. I know you want to be big for everyone, but you're just a kid. Like me. Sometimes you're scared, just like any other kid. So I'll help. You said all the policemen and firefighters died. So I'm going to be a new one. Even if I don't get it just right, I am. Because all it means is killing bad people who hurt other people. And I'm good at that. Like, I think I could be the best at killing bad people. Better than you, even. Because I wouldn't hesitate. Hey, Jay, I'm starting to believe that you like it. The killing. The power of it. No, I don't. It gives me nightmares, and it makes me breathe funny any time I have to do it. But I like making things feel safe for everybody. I need you to trust me, Clem. That I can tell the good people and the bad people apart. That I know when to use my gun. And that you'll let me decide for my own. Okay. Really? Firefighters have to make the hard calls, which means they deserve our trust. And if they kill to protect others, they're never happy about it. Killing people doesn't make me happy, Clem. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. Come on. Wie sind die denn jetzt da rüber gekommen? Naja. Und eine sehr schöne Unterhaltung war. Bin ich bin ja echt mal gespannt, wo wir da rauskommen.
Ja. Gut getimt mit der Fackel. Coast is clear. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. A sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon, you already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A sim was the third vote. Wait, that means Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Huh. What made you think of that? A sim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. I just, I just thought you should know. The sim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. You made that go away. As bad as Marlon was, he still saved me and AJ. And you nursed me back to health. We owed you for that. Maybe, but... Even so, if Marlon was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever, or dead. Instead, we fought back, because you showed us how. We weren't safe with Marlon, even in his safe zone. We were just hiding. Huh? Huh? Na, wer kommt jetzt? Violet! Violet! You made it. You're all alive. Did everyone else escape? Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Auf geht's. Well, we were looking for you guys, and I, I thought you might be gone for good. Oh, shit. I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone, and I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie for a whole fucking year. I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. And I still couldn't tell you why. Because you were afraid of losing someone else. It's understandable. I was a goddamn coward. I'm not a coward anymore. Jesus, everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. 
I remember how Marlon described it and what we were going to turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. How did you picture it? I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlon said. How it would be a home. A real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around. family lived in a trailer. Mm, what about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? I had a tree house in the backyard. I used to take my walkie-talkie up there and play for hours. I'd pretend it was a ship, and I was the pirate captain. Or it was an igloo, and I was a hunter. <laughs> or a castle, and I was a princess. Really? Like with frilly dresses and a tiara? Yeah, but also a sword. A warrior princess. Yeah, obviously. And the treehouse kept me alive when all this started. That's where I hid. You know, Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, we'll start rebuilding. <sighs> It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. Hell, we could even put in a treehouse. We've already got a bell tower. Okay, we'll build a bell tower house. Perfect. After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it. Defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? That stupid fucking name, Erickson. You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah. Fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. Threatening, but not like scary. Something that makes assholes go, I should stay away. But not like blood murder knife house. You name it, it was your idea. Texas. We're calling it Texas. You can't just name it Texas. Fine. Texas too. I want to help rebuild our school. You will, Ten. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. Let's get home to Texas, too. Gut. Wie Texas 2 dann aussieht oder was noch von übrig ist, sehen wir in der nächsten Folge. Bis dann.